Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Animalia, I'm the Marmoset and we're playing City Skyline. So, just having a look at our nice little city, we've got here a bustling 43,500 people and it's like, well where are we going to expand to next? Well, first up, we're flicking the flag down here, a medium demand for industry and offices, so I'm probably going to be looking at seeing what we can do about reinforcing this area and increasing its capacity. One of the things I want to have a look at before I get too far stuck into that, however, is... This. We've got a bit of empty space and some spare, pa spare space rattling in around here. Now, there is a great deal of plans for going and expanding into this area, so I want to do a little bit of future proofing first, which generally involves moving that roundabout on top of the motorway, so that we actually get stuck in and sort that out. So, what we will be doing is doing an awful lot of deleting. Is that just zoned industrial? What are you? Taxi depots. Okay, fair enough. Might have to move you another point. This is all, those are taxi depots. Okay, fair enough. What's this? Bus depot, firehouse, incineration plant. Alright, so that's just in a right, Let's get these guys emptying so I can move them at a later date. But, let's quickly dump that taxi depot. Oh, there is this bit of space there, not necessarily too much. Let's drop these taxi depots off over here for now. I suspect that they will probably be needed at some point, but they can just go and stay over there for now, which means I can now merrily delete that road and get rid of this roundabout and just continue to demolish all of this. I'm not going to unpause it because we've got an awful lot of traffic routes, bus routes, and all sorts of other bits and pieces. They're going to get horribly confused. And also, I'm going to take out quite a chunk of the motorway because I have a standardized roundabout right now. Ah, and I can just shift that up one. So let's stick a flyover roundabout in and see if we can do about rejoining these highways. Let's put the ones with the dampers in. You are going which way? That way, okay. So I grab you. Get that up that way. Grab you. Get that up that way. Great. Good, good, good. Alright, so that's our roundabout in. Let's extend our hub road all the way up to about here. Yes, I know the roundabout's right off-centered. I don't mind. And we will put in a dedicated... Now, that is two-way. Okay, fair enough. Let's um, just sort that little kink out we've managed to accrue by having you come all the way up to about there and then we will get I don't quite know why we've got such a large road there connect that into there so that lot can connect now into the rest of the network and just finally piece together no, no that went in, that's in, that's in ah, there's the missed connection we had get that all in. Right, okay. So then thinking, 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 looking, looking, looking. So a nice long strip all the way down here. Would be really good if we could get a little bit slightly quicker access into these districts from the top, just to alleviate perhaps some of the pressure that's on our roads down here. I wonder, can we you know, we can just extend that just a little bit and fill in a little bit more housing. Let's make this light commercial, though I don't necessarily want down that side. What about what we're going to do here in just a sec, but in the interim, let's, let's leave a gap between the two. Yeah, let's not pack this in too much. Right, okay, so now we've got that little lot in, what we need to do is think about well, how we're going to stop in this. So I was talking about future proofing because I wanted to put another road in. 
So what we'll be doing is grabbing all that, grabbing all this. So we now have remember with sound, how are we sound barrier? We are left hand drive, so we want to be going that way goes to the left hand side, so we will start here, go forward, a minimum amount. No, that's I want that, no, thank you very much. Space already occupied by the right away. Okay, fair enough. Looks like we will be cutting that road back a little bit. Okay, so let's start from back back here. Give us the smallest amount of road we possibly can. Come down. Across. Come up. Twice. So that we can get across the railway line. And then come down. Okay. Right. And from the opposite side, we will essentially do the same. Come up. Step over till it's green. Go straight. And come up to the surface. Yep, I know. They're not parallel. They're not remotely parallel. It's a really, really quite difficult and a monumental pain in the ass to get these things to be parallel at the best of times. Really? Okay, that's kind of annoying. So just delete that and we'll do it backwards. <laughs> or not. Okay, that's one that way, and then you go out like so. Right. Hmm. Not the greatest, but it's because it's offset. That's the main problem. It's offset by quite a bit. <laughs> I think perhaps. The right about itself can be offset as much as we like. What matters is that you can connect between the two with some measure of rationality. So, what I care about more than anything else is traffic being able to get into the city easily. So. Let's draw a straight line out from here, and then reverse this direction. Leave that one, and then we'll take our curved road and have the exit route trying to get as parallel as I possibly can. Oh, I can save myself a bit of trouble with trying to get it, trying to get it parallel. Let's use a quick guide road and then delete those two. I want you to be about there. So let's see if I can get it to. That will depend on. No, I figured they wouldn't let me do that. Come on. That will be nicer. Delete that. Ideally. No, I can't quite delete that. Hmm, balls. And I can't just do an undo. No, go to, go to without you in the EU. That's about here -ish. Come across. Come out. Delete. Let's try this again. No, I did not want a line that was a road that was straight. I wanted a road that was curved.
distance too short, eh? That will be nice thing. Yeah, I know I'm going to have to find a way of connecting this in, but I'll do that in a bit. In the interim, what I want is to get this lot connected up. So you will come down, go across, and then come back up before going up. Oh, I've got it set to the minimum amount of... Oh. No good. Uh, give me that amount of up. 12 meters. And then come across. And what we'll do is we'll just go out with in the wrong direction along here. No, don't snap. Just go straight. And then come up, come across. Now what I am going to do is I am going to come out just a little bit and put that strange concoctionally loop on the end so that if anyone does end up going down one of these for some curious reason they are not going to a position where they are going to get entrapped. So, we now have a north-south highway and an east-west highway. So, there's a question we've got, is there an embankment or slope we've got in this area? It's really pretty when you get nice and So now, we need to connect this to the roundabout and that to the roundabout. So, simply going nicely, we've got traffic, it's going to tell us which way we're going to go, so we can just go grab, come off, and connect, and then come off, and connect, and just do the same on the other side, come off, fine. Connect and then come off. Fine, right, come off slightly somewhere else. Do I need to have you duck down a little earlier? I think I need to have you duck down a little earlier. Connect. Wait, no, make sure I'm on straight mode. Connect. Come along. Connect. Okay, yep, shiny. Yeah, I'll probably do the same to this one. No, it's just essentially just what I got rid of. But I also need to reverse the direction. Okay, so now we've got a bit more space. We can go back to B and R. It roads. Okay, so now you can get up on and off of it. Now you need to be able to exchange that information with this. So if you are trying to get from the roundabout to there, I'm going to make that actually. No, I'm going to upgrade that to a full size one because I suspect that is going to be. Going the wrong way. <laughs> Very busy bit of road. And I am going to put in a auxiliary shortcut going the other way, because I know for a while that I suspect that it's also going to be a very busy road, but I just need to get you up onto the right about in such a way that it is rational with the direction of the roundabout. Now, obviously this is going to carry on and going somewhere else later on, so I can't just have it peel off and come round that way. There isn't space there. there might be space from here. I think I might be already occupied.
that'll do. Get you up onto the roundabout if you want to go that way. The quickest way is that way if you want to go left. So onto that side, up that side. This roundabout is going around the wrong way. There we go. Now it's coming around the right way. Right, so we can quite easily get ourselves from here to there. We'll probably put some kind of shortcut road on later on. Just stop people just trimming that edge off. But we need to get away from here to here. Not really, there's not the space. Hmm. Okay. Can I just connect like that? Can. So we want to come off from here and join there. Bit convoluted. I mean, it's basically, in no way, shape or form, not helped by the fact that I off-centered this and because I'm stubborn and couldn't be bothered to fix it, I've left it where it is. I think it looks interesting, actually. I, yeah, it's all squiggly and it's all a bit weird. Now we've got Major on an act, in an act road sorted. I am actually going to switch that back to a single lane and put in that as a dedicated traverse there. And do remember to swap the direction of that one, otherwise all help will break this. Okay, so dedicated in, dedicated out to get onto that highway because that's the shortcut, and then we've got extra terrain and all the rest of it. So let's just quickly check. Okay, so that bus route doesn't look like it's going to be too troubled. That bus route doesn't look like it's going to be too troubled. So now at the moment, the only way to getting in this industrial area is by coming in over here. Now, that is something we do not want. So we want to be able to get in and out of this industrial area in a sane and rational manner. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I did try. I yeah, No, I know. Sane and rational manner. So let's grab that. Come across. Down, connect, and we will repaint in there, and paint here, and then put commercial back in, and then we will turn this into essentially a minor motorway interchange. And then we will spend a fair bit of time tinkering with the... And it's probably better if you do do it. Ooh, thank you very much. Little notification thing. Switch the direction of view. 
We do try and make it a slightly smoother intercept. I think it will probably help. And then coming from here. Goodbye, road. And we shall put a slight arc on that one just to accommodate the fact that it's a bit of a messy junction. So that's connected in that to the network. We will finish up this before we end the episode. Let's just grab my little industry painting tool. That's a single dot. I don't want that. And just design some of this briefly before I colour it back in carefully. I'll leave a gap between the two. Fine, I'll bin break each individual little one along there. And I think do I have a tree brush? I'm reasonably sure I bought a tree brush. And I did bring a tree brush. Treated leaves. I will just fill that in with some trees just to try and reduce some of the noise and the pollution we're going to get from around here. And now we're going to get the traffic president out with the change lane arrows option. And we are going to have you as only left turn. And you are going to be no right turns. Maybe that way. You can go any direction you like from there. You can be only left turns. You can be any direction you like from there. You should be no right turns. Okay, so that lane goes that way. That lane goes this way. That lane goes that way. That lane goes that way. So if you want to get over here, you come off there and go that way. And if you want to go across, you just go across. Okay. Let's see how badly this goes horribly wrong. There are lights. I don't want lights there. Manual traffic lights. Nope, I don't want that. Change lane arrows. Switch traffic lights. No lights. No lights. There shouldn't be any traffic crossing the direction. I just want people filtering in and out. And you should be emptying and then just dashing off and getting rid of debris such as we need. Don't mind there being lights here. <laughs> and those garbage trucks are wending their merry way. And then, yeah, so that meant something else. The garbage getting between these two zones is going to be a bit quicker. Still get an out. Yes, okay. Wow, that's a lot of trucks that have suddenly redirected. Just going to do a quick little zone check. Yep, the monkey thing does go all the way up to here. Brown. All right, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Here is our new and shiny and very fancy motorway system. So it appears that people who want to get down to here have decided that the quickest way of doing it is rather than using... Just double-check we've got the, the routings correct. The quickest way to path is to come in and come off, come around, go over there, and then back down that way. Oh, looks like we've got... A lane problem that we should probably fix while we've got the chance. Uh, lane arrows, this one. Straight, straight, straight. Straight, straight, straight. <laughs> yes. Shouldn't be anything other than straight, straight, straight there. Shouldn't have anyone turning at all. I'm going to let them also... One final change of the episode goes straight on. Okay. Fine. Apparently, they decided that's the quickest way of doing that. Double left that way. I suppose it just does loop round and doesn't go anywhere, so we'll sort that out later. Alright, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. We've got a new traffic junction here. We've got a new traffic junction over here. 
We'll see how badly this one does in the long term. It appears to be snarling up just a little bit, but thankfully we've got the extra lanes down here to sort it out. I've been the Marmoset, this has been City Skylines Animalia. Please remember to like and subscribe.